Welcome to Biomutant. Take the environment in and enjoy it while it lasts.
Moš, moš. Says they've been waiting for you to help them liberate the outpost. They've scouted the outpost while they were waiting and suggests you have a look at what they found before entering. The scout spotted a well being used by the outpost. Mess with its filter and you could sicken their troops. Claims they won't feel... in there and ruin that filter. So different from the surface down here. So much damage. Half dead. Finished him off. Just a few moves left. Make them count. Got it. Nothing but greasy goo in their pipes now. Looks like the outpost found out about the bad water the hard way. The outpost belongs to your tribe now. He says you made them weaker, but they won't give up.
Your Sifu thanks you. Your tribe is growing stronger. He says you did a great job capturing the outpost. You're one step closer to ending the tribe war. Hello. Says you're in good company there. This place can feel like it's closing in around you. The Underfoot Outpost, right where the Pichu tribe dug it up. There's the tyrant who runs this outpost. He didn't expect his tribe to lose as they're the ones that are ruthless. There's no way he'll surrender just because of threats. He can recognize the strength of a good argument and agrees it's for the best. He'll surrender the outpost to you. The outpost belongs to your tribe now. He says you made them weaker, but they won't give up. Your Sifu thanks you. Your tribe is growing stronger. Thinks you did a great job capturing the rival's third outpost and believes the rival is weak enough to engage them at their fort. Says it will be a relief to finally have it over.
They've been waiting for you. Taking control of this fort will bring peace between your tribes. You better be. A tribe's fort is a bigger... They've managed to roll a bang ball against the fort and the plan is to... Indeed it is. Don't trip over what you can't see. Starting to add up. It's time to set the rival tribe free. Inflict... Convince... The Mega Muck in that cake. Just get out of the Mega Muck's way. The day is always brighter.
The wire claw looks like it's strong enough to pull down a gate. But you just need to aim straight, shoot and pull, and the gate will come down. The Pishu tribe supports natural evolution on the dogma that only the strong survive. They want to help evolution on its way by conquering the tribes, as they're all too weak in their convictions. Anybody home? He didn't expect it would go down this way. It'll be hard to talk your way out of a fight. He's not sure if you're likable enough to just give up the fort without a fight. He realizes a peaceful end would be best. He'll entrust the fort to you. The rival Sifu is defeated, and the destiny of their tribe is in your hands. You are free to choose their fate, but not free from the consequences of your choice. He'll leave it up to you to decide the fate of... Thinks it's a good gesture to offer support to others when you can see that they need it. And with that, you're spinning your own fate good or bad, never to be undone. Side by side they'll stand until order and stability is reinstituted. They've achieved a great thing for the tribe and the land by winning the war. The other tribes will see your side of things with time. You'll succeed quickest by helping others succeed. This is why uniting the tribes is so important. It's only together that you'll stand strong. When you first met, the world was divided and filled with fear. But you've come a long way on your path towards a world ruled by truth and justice. He says it'll take some time for the tribes to come together as one, even if the tribe war has ended. Saving the Tree of Life will be a task you have to tackle on your own. You know better than anyone that the fate of the world is still at stake. You need a word. Our conscience is that little voice inside that lets you know right from wrong. Don't go against it if you want to enjoy life without fear of death. It's the Pichu Nanchuk. You can't wait to get out, can you?
Out of date says there'll be consequences of the war, but there are more pressing matters at hand. The last World Eater has been left undisturbed with the tree while you focused on the war. He thought someone with your light perspective and key would have had different priorities and faced the World Eaters before resolving the Tribe War. Regardless, Out of Date is grateful the Tribe War is over. Out of Date understands the road has been rough, but you already know what's left to end this journey, and it'll be tough. You're the only one that's strong enough to face the last World Eater. The future depends on someone with a light perspective to give the world a chance to survive. Only time will tell what the future holds, and if it will bring a lasting peace for those that make it to the end. Out of date says the word about what you've done so far is spreading. The tribes haven't lost hope yet. He appreciates what you've done so far, but unfortunately he's had urgent news from his friend Wiz in the Northwest. He's unsure about your intentions, but hopes you'll support Wiz. He says he'll point you in the right direction, but finding Wiz and making sure he gets what he needs is up to you. That doesn't sound good. Out of date's hunch is real. The Merc Puff is up next. Out of date says that Wiz is worried now that the Northwest World Eater is stepping up its activity. Come, Reaper. He explains that Wiz is working on an undersurf vessel in order to get to the World Eater, but needs help to get it done. Out of date suggests that you should head northwest as fast as possible and see what you can do to help. He's happy to help. Says you'll see each other later. So much water!
The Surge Surf Factory. Keep your eye out for whiz while you're here. Let's see. The best story. Toxanol's mining led to mass deforestation and increased global warming as nature couldn't absorb the carbon dioxide and greenhouse gas emissions without the trees. These irreversible changes to the climate also contributed to the evolution and modified our genetic code. Look at the notices on that board. No one paid much attention to them, it looks like. Wiz should be around here somewhere, probably taking care of his guppos. A surge surf factory was one of the cleaner ways to make power, until the... The power comes from turning the movement of the surf into surge sparks. Sometimes science is beyond belief. There are sure to be more tracks around here, maybe by the shore. We're all heroes of our own stories, or so we hope. Wooz isn't easy on the tongue, but I think he says he's happy to see a friendly face. Not too many of those around these days. Nick says it's good to see you again. He's Wiz. You might remember him from the old days when he let you try his octopod? I never will remember. Wiz remembers you were such a cheery kid, and he's glad to see that light hasn't faded from you, despite the years. But Wiz understands it was a long time ago, and memories get murkier the deeper you go. But they've been here for you since you were a kidling, but when you left, you also chose to distance yourself from everyone that cared for you. Wiz says our memory keeps things for us, preserves them until we are ready to face them again. He knows you've returned to face Lupa Lupin and that confrontation is as inevitable as the tides. Uliana. He's not surprised that the loss of your family could plunge you into the depths forever, but you've always been able to rise like a bubble to the surface, no matter what. Don Antica Urbaya Unara. He knows that though the tides of history may push you in one direction, you can always lay your own course. Ultimately, it's your choice. You were the one to be wronged and have lived with the consequences. He believes in consequence as it's a direct result of action. Asks if you ever think about freedom and whether any of us really has it. Did you make the decisions that brought you here, or are you just a pawn of fate?
Velir Nilachale. Glad to hear that. He only wishes he was that sure about himself. No, Kajika. Amazed the world is going to continue on, but happy to hear it. Still so many things to invent. <laughs> Impressed that you fought so hard to keep the world spinning. Thinks you were smart to join with the Myriad. They have a rainbow of ways to approach any problem. Thinks that kind of diversity brings strength. But that's not nearly as important as this. Wiz says that you should let the past dwell in the depths. But there's something else down there too, gnawing at the Tree of Life. He's named it the Merc Puff. This is why he's tinker-tonkering with the Octopod. But the lid got stuck, so he needs a big enough tug twister to open it up and let you a go in. He can't leave the surge station, so you must help him find a tug twister. There's a wound up Mecha Fingro in the Mecha Stadium that still has one stuck on its back. Find it, and you'll find the tug twister. Getting that tool will help turn around the situation for sure. It'll definitely help him unshut the hatch. <laughs> 